hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to the recipe of the week. Today is Resurrection Sunday. So glad he died so we could live and that we are, we are living. I was listening to this song this morning, God is Good by Jonathan McReynolds, but Jonathan Nelson was singing it as a tribute to Jonathan McReynolds and my God from Zion. There's a puddle of water over there by my couch. The song says, may your struggles keep you near the cross and may your troubles show that you need God. Because if we didn't have any troubles, Lord have mercy. We wouldn't need God and we need him every second, every minute. And may your battles end the way they should. And may your bad days prove that God is good. Jesus. Let me play a little bit of the song. That you need God. You need God. What it boils down to, God is good. God is good. And David knew a little something about God being good. The recipe of the week is coming from Psalms 40, verses 1 through 3, and that's the message. And 40, 16 through 17, the message. And the word of the Lord reads, I waited and waited and waited for God. At last, he looked. Finally, he listened. He lifted me out of the ditch, pulled me out from deep mud. Press pause. God is good. He was in a ditch. He pulled him out. He was in mud. He pulled him out. Continuing to read. He stood me up on a solid rock and that he is. He's the rock, our rock, to make sure I wouldn't slip. He taught me how to sing the latest God song, a praise song to our God. More and more people are seeing this. They enter the mystery abandoning themselves to God. Psalms 40 verses 16 through 17. But all who are hunting for you, Oh, let them sing and be happy because when you're in the Lord, come on, somebody, you're singing and you're happy regardless. Somebody say regardless, regardless of what you find yourself in, you're singing and you're happy. Continuing to read. Let those who know what you're all about tell the world you're great and not quitting. And me, I'm a mess. I'm nothing and I have nothing. Make something of me. You can do it. You've got what it takes, but God, don't put it off. God is so very good. David found himself in a pit, in a hole, in a mess, in a situation. Somebody say David found himself in a situation, but the God that we serve is so good. What happened on Calvary? Come on, somebody. You guys know the story. Our God 
sent his only son to die for our sins. David was calling and calling and beckoning for the Lord and he came. He pulled David out of that pit. There's several different versions of this particular passage of scripture. I admonish you to read them all. That's Psalms 40. Very, very great reading. If you find yourself in something, see how David got out of it. Of course, God got him out of it. He always does. He always will. I say this a million times over. He will never, somebody say never, never leave nor forsake us. Regardless, somebody say regardless, regardless of what we're in. He will never give up on us, ever. He will never quit on us. Thank you, God, for grace and mercy. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, Lord. Now, we're down in the pit. You're still good. When we're down in the mud, you are still good. When we find ourselves laid up in sand, Father, you can pull us out of it. You are good. Lord, you pull David out of that pit and out of that mud and out of that mock, all of it. God, we know you can do that for us. So God, when we see ourselves, when we find ourselves in a situation, in pain, in hurt, in struggle, in hardship, in pain, you are still good. And we thank you for it. We thank you for it. We honor you for it. Father, I'm praying for everyone to have an amazing, amazing week and know that in our struggles and in our problems, you are still God and you are still good. Amen. And we thank you, Father. You guys have an amazing week. Enjoy your family this week. Enjoy your family every day. Family is good. Family is good. You guys have an amazing week. I love you. But most of all, God loves you bigger and better than I ever, ever could.